been feeling a lot better ever since he heard about what happened. So many awesome stories. You take on any I do not fight for my home. We're looking at another How about it? You hungry? Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. No need to get up. Stay back. Cut! Can't try us alone. Gotta get a little payback for my partner. Come on, then. I won't give up. I'll take care. Pretty 
strong, isn't he? Hmm. I've seen this type of fool. <laughs> you don't know me. How's that payback working out for you? Oh, better than expected. Yeah! <laughs> Shit! Okay. All right. I thought you didn't want to get rough. No, but this is self-defense. Go on. You're mine. Shit. Enough. needed on standby for a job at something about Sector 7. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Wait a sec. So, you coming? Talking to the Shh. So yeah, it was that kind of day.
Let's go. Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey. What'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But, you know... Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me, after all. <clears throat> Probably not. Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. It won't be much longer now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they... Need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But, before they can... There's a final step that has to be taken. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. Learn to talk to her. Did the flower say anything? Uh, good work today, guys? <laughs> That's the spirit! You're heading in already? Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? Uh. <sighs> I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you on the straight and narrow. And tell you when you're being a silly goose. 
That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. Stay my welcome. Huh. What are you doing? Nothing. Did you have a bad dream? Don't worry, you'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh, okay. <sighs> Please don't let her hear me again. Jerk! I thought I told you not to leave your room. Now get back in there. Okay. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If it isn't the new florist. I appreciate you helping the kids out today, thank you. They won't stop talking about the soldier who saved the day. Oh, and make sure to give my thanks to Aerith, too. Sure. The kids are talking about you like they found themselves a new hero. Thank you for being there for the children. I really appreciate it. Who knew talking to the kids about the past would make you feel so... I can still hear the sound of the reactor exploding. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. 
<laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> Nothing. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident, and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but... And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. <laughs> 